And there's one critical thing that I did do though. I took action. Yes, that action was fueled by pure excitement. That's a good thing. Because if I'd stopped to think about what I was going to say and about how I was going to say it, then I might have said nothing. I've got a saying, get in your head, you're dead. If I'd stopped to think in that way, I'd have been dead. I might have taught myself out of even speaking to Mark. You might do this with people in your life right now. And I might have said to myself, Aaron, who do you think you are? You've got no proper experience. Why would Mark want to work with you? And all of those things were true. That's why taking action is more important than trying to get everything perfect. You might be a perfectionist. You might be someone who always wants things to be perfect. I'd far rather you took action and took 10 decisive pieces of action today and you still got you know, two or three of them wrong, but you still move forward seven steps rather than took no action because you needed to wait for it to be perfect. Imagine in your life taking seven successful steps every day, however small they are, in a week, that's another 49 steps beyond the person that waits for perfection. And the things that you get wrong, they're not going to be disasters. They're just going to be mistakes. And you learn from them. Whereas if you don't take action, you don't even get to learn and put it right later.